hey guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are doing all right i seriously don't know the last time i picked up my phone to record but it's been quite busy i apologize the lighting in my room is horrible and um i have my curtains closed so yeah so as you read by the title today i will be doing uh, my room tour finally i've been asked um a lot of times to be doing my room tour um since like last year and i'm finally doing it um so yeah guys i hope you guys like comment and subscribe if you have any questions do let me know um as i'll also be talking about my uni and some advantages and disadvantages so you can kind of be prepared maybe i'll do a video of like what to bring but i'm pretty sure you can do like that research online and you will know what to bring for uni anyways so yeah, guys let's get on the video This is my flat, I'm flat E. That's the hallway, that's another flat. There's another flat around the corner. So there's three flats per floor in my building. Um, so we get, get get given a lift. We have basically five floors. Um, let me call the lift. Who's coming? Also it's because of COVID. Uh, only one person is allowed, but no one really follows that rule, to be honest. And yeah, so that's the lift and yeah oh yeah this is like a disabled toilet as well no idea what's in these cupboards whatever but yeah obviously to get into the building you'd have to scan oh god and there you go full of 10 flats <laughs> I used to have like a name as like everyone else but I took it down um and forgot to replace it um with something else so you see you need your key card to open okay so the lighting is very bad in my room I do apologize let me just put my key in here so okay so first off let me open my toilet door maybe I'll give you some light in oh there you go um so first off, I do have my hangers here. I have some jackets. Oh, let me just. Okay, go. I've got some jackets in here, handbags, um, bags, etc. And then in this little corner, I bought this dog from Amazon. It's like a door holder thing, but it doesn't hold this door, which is what really annoyed me. So I've just kept it there for decoration. It still, it still has a tag and everything. Okay, so so as soon as you enter, you will see the toilet. So this is the toilet. Um, so that's the shower. It's quite big. I mean, quite small, sorry. It does fit me. I did used to have a bath mat, but because um, it got dirty and then I went home for a few weeks, so I was like, there's no point of me buying one. And because I'm going home again next week for like a couple of months, uh, there's no point of me wasting my money to buy one. So I've cut my shampoos there my sponge show you that's the size of it and then it comes with like this mirror and then i've kept my brushes and everything else over there um i bought that mat for the floor i do advise you to buy a mat for your toilet floor because you don't want to step on you know the floor of your foot barefooted and everything got my towel that my mom got me i literally love this towel it's from like i think it's from next home it comes with like a b oh gosh a b for like my name um i've got my towels here so i've got that one that i got given with my name on it and my um bath towel i put i've bought, it, ooh, gosh, I bought these two baskets this one here obviously for my pads and stuff my brushes and that basket for just some random toilet stuff that I just for i put them i bought that um stand from b&m just to keep my toilet stuff um that bin you can get that bin anywhere to be honest but i got mine from i think home base so yeah that's the toilet sorry guys my phone cut out but yeah so i bought that um toilet stand as well not toilet stand sorry no toilet roll stand for my toilet paper <laughs> So 
so yeah so come out of the room now and then on the left side here we've got this big ass mirror which is to be honest is amazing i've bought these um string lights for my wall with some photos um obviously i had to use sellotape because i couldn't use um the other little material they gave me because obviously this is not my wall and i do want my deposit back so i just had to improvise and use the tape and blue tack which to be honest looks a bit ugly but yeah and then i got all the photos over here um i've just decided to put the plot in there i didn't know where else to put it i bought the well like, actually i got this from home to dry my underwear and obviously you've got the radiator here but to be honest my room is so hot so i just keep it open at all times then we've got, I've got the board for um obviously to put on information, I'm not information, sorry, oh my gosh, uh, like important stuff to remember and everything else. I've got my ring light, I had to put it on to get some lighting in this room. My laundry room, I didn't know whether to put it there, I mean, not laundry room, oh my god, it was wrong with me today. My laundry basket, I didn't know whether to put it there or in that little corner where the dog is, but because when you open the door... It kind of pushes the laundry basket. So I thought, you know what, let me just leave it there. And the room is quite small. So I didn't want to, like, do too much and, you know, put it over there. I don't know. So, yeah, I got that ring light. This ring light, I got it from Home Bargains for literally nineteen ninety nine. So I advise you guys to get one. So, yeah, so this is my desk. I've got my TV there. Pardon me. Um, got my PS4, my laptop, and obviously some other um stationary stuff i've decided to put my suitcase there because first it was under my bed but because i actually go home quite a lot taking out a suitcase under the bed is just so long so you know i was like do you know what let me just leave it there the room comes with a bin which is good so i don't have to waste my money to buy a bin we've got the chair um obviously we've got these drawers over here this one comes with a lock so you can put like your important stuff i just got a student finance stuff certificates passport etc and then this one, I've just got like stationary books, paper, whatever, whatever. Third one, just charges and some papers. I don't really use these drawers to be honest. Um, but yeah, so the desk is quite big. It's all right. I mean, it's enough for me, anyways. So obviously, you've got the comes with these grey curtains. I then put these plants over here, and I get a nice view. It's currently like probably like seven thirty towards eight. So. That's my view, that's the other buildings. Um so yeah, so now I'm gonna show you this. I don't you call this shelf, I guess. Um I've put some birthday cards that I've got given this year. Um, this glass shot that someone gave me. Um these came on these these little drinks came on my my birthday cake my mum made me it. So I just left it there. I've got that, these two baskets. I keep that basket for water bottles, that basket for drinks. And then I bought these little two plants. I think I got these two plants along with that one from Ikea. And then that little heart shape thingy. don't know what that's called. <laughs> um, I got it from b and I believe. Can't remember how much. And then I bought these lights here from amazon i think they were like a tenner they turn on i'll show you oh yeah i'll show you these lights and that light in a minute um maybe towards the end of the video it's really cute when it's dark um but yeah obviously you've got that board over there it comes with like letters i also got that from amazon i just had to put you only live once that's literally my favorite uh i guess quote um but yeah i got these i put these two fancy bags over there i also bought that b from amazon no wait sorry no i bought it from um ebay it was actually like a five or, or like five pounds 30 i'll leave the link for like all these decorations um in the description so you guys can check it out um but yeah that also turns on i'll show you and then i little I bought that little smell thing uh from home bargains and then my sliders that i got given for my birthday and then this side over here i decided to put all my books and then buy these two baskets from i think b and m and then put all like this one has makeup and of a stuff this one is like sprays um creams etc perfumes and then i've got this one here with like all the eyeshadows bear in mind i don't even wear makeup like that only on um special occasions and then i bought that cookie jar which i to be honest i love with my cookies over there so yeah this is 
the shelf is actually quite big you can actually fit quite a lot in it to be honest um but yeah oh yeah i got this board here i believe from ebay two pounds fifty and then i wrote that quote um to kind of like motivate me in a way okay so my room is a single bed so i pay 140 a week for this room um you can obviously i'll talk i might do another video about this but uh, you can get in my building anyways there's um the double room which is a double bed is much different i might put a picture on for you guys to see that one is 150 a week but obviously my building is for students who do placements so i've decided to be here so i could have like um people in my flat who do the same course as me and luckily i did get two um obviously my flat i, sh I should have mentioned that i've been gonna go to the video my flat is well had 10 people but each flat has 10 people mine was full girls even though i picked mixed but it's all right i got full i uh, got all girls and but currently there's literally three of us right now um but at the beginning there were 10 of us so yeah so i got that um clove dryer that i bought you can get these ones for like 10 or 10 is probably like from like home bargains b and i haven't even opened that one that one's new because my old one broke but i haven't used that one because i was home for for a long time so i didn't need to use that um my mom bought me this like shoe kind of thing i can put my shoes there but i haven't used this so i might bring back home because i don't i don't really need that but yeah i put my some of my trainers there so yeah so this is my bed i've got my big teddy that's getting quite old now um i didn't know how to put up the bed but i just decided to make it like this i love the color gray it's my favorite color so i thought mm, let me make it gray um but yeah the bed's perfect for me at the bottom i just literally put um just some random stuff um that I don't need. Well, that's my cleaning stuff. Not see my TV. But oh yeah, I got my snack box, which to be honest, I legit love. <laughs> got all my snacks in there and everything. So this is like my little side table, and I've got this bun for my birthday, which I absolutely love. Um, I think it's from Amazon, I believe. I bought myself the camera, and I didn't know where to put it because I have no. Sp First it was over there, but because I bought the B, I had to take it, and I didn't know where else to put it, so I just left it there. And then I've got my, got some extra stuff here, hand sanitizer, my wallet, um, a little remote, some boxes, face masks. I've got these for obviously my clothes. Um, these are just a box of medication. And yeah, so let me try and show you the view of the room. I feel like I've got a lot of stuff in this room actually. The room is quite like packed and everything. So yeah, so this is the room cool so the last thing in this room is this teeny tiny teeny whiny um wardrobe which to be honest here is quite small i just put my it's like a works kind of thing every time i come in i have to tap that in and i just put my mask there so it is quite small to be honest um but it was a struggle to fit in everything because i've got quite a lot of jumpers and a few jackets which were, which is why i had to put my most jackets over there but yeah, I've got these jackets here. And then I decided to put my shoes there at the bottom. And then my clothes. I bought these little boxes from my underwear. Um, and then some for my socks. Well, socks is underwear, right? <laughs> and then I've kept my white t-shirts, black t-shirts, bodysuits at the back. Looks quite messy, actually. Uh, my jeans. Um, I've put my bedding stuff there. My pyjamas. And at the very back, I've got some dresses and all the fancy clothes and shorts at the back. But yeah, it is quite a small, but um, I was able to fit in everything. There you go. I will show you how to get into the flat as well. And the living room and kitchen. But yeah, so this is my room. Which, to be honest, at first when I came in here, it was quite small. Like, I felt like it was quite small. Um, but then I was like, you know what, Bruno? It's only for you. So let's not complain. It's uni. So, yeah. <laughs> Turn on the 
on the lights so I can show you how it looks in the dark. Uh, and yeah, I literally love it. I used to have LED lights actually, but mine broke and I didn't want to get it anymore because I'm moving out soon. So like, you know what? There's no point of wasting money anymore. But yeah, this is really cute. Oh yeah, and I also have skylights, which um, is, it was more expensive actually. It was like 30 quid. Um, the only reason why it's 30 is because it comes with a speaker, which I didn't know. So guys, when you buy stuff, please read the description because I don't. And you can change like all the colors and it looks so nice. I love it. I think this is my favorite one. Um, it's really cute. I literally love it. Okay, so one thing I do like about being in this room is that the kitchen is... Oh, let me take my ID because I love myself out. The kitchen is right here. Oh, there's some light. Oh, there you go. And that one. There you go. So yeah, one thing I do like about being in that room is that I'm literally right next to the kitchen. So yeah, so first things first, we've got this big ass sofa here. Um, it's quite big, plus those two little ones. Um, oh my days, I've literally had, we've had this for like a month now, more than a month. Um, <laughs> it was for my birthday and they're still up, so quite good. Um, let me put my ID there. So yeah, we also get this view from um, the um, living room. Um, we get a TV. Uh, we just put some games under there but yeah we've got like a little table here um it's quite comfy to be honest and then we get this table i think we get like four chairs we've got one over there one over here one over there and one over here i've got this board on do not do not ask what happened here a lot of stuff happened here we just put like a whole mess on this board so yeah we then have the sofa and it's basically this couch where we so we got, we'll get three fridges um, and three freezers between 10 people so i have the middle one i've got my stuff here there and i use those two shelves um and then the freezer i believe i've got two drawers for myself as well i've got that one and this one and yeah so each cupboard comes with a lock um and my one is over here. One thing I disliked um, about my one is that it's smaller than everyone else's. So if you get a room six, I'm not sure in every building, but my building anyways, in my great bond field, you literally get the smallest cupboard if you're room six. So good luck <laughs> about that. So yeah, we get given a microwave, toaster, and just some extra stuff. Two kettles, one over there, one over there. And then here, this is the view. Can't really see much but that's the learning hub where most people have their lessons um but yeah, you don't can't really see much you get this two rack dryers i think that's what they're called right <laughs> i mean drying racks what the heck <laughs> you get one over there one over there obviously um two sinks as well where is my other one why am i oh <laughs> and then you get also given one at the bottom which i put my um Pans and some extra stuff all my plates are in my room so i kind of need to get that to wash and yeah so this is it guys i feel like yeah it's quite a big actually obviously you get the living room area sitting area or whatever and the kitchen but i'll show you how to get into my flat as well and oh yeah and to the building oh no to the building that's all right um but oh yeah we also get given free bins we did one for recycling general waste and food waste and then this cupboard here um we have the hoover and some other cleaning stuff and yeah guys i'll go back to my room oh yeah sorry i forgot to mention it got two ovens as well two stoves um i don't even think that one works to be honest um sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't it's a bit bipolar with us sometimes but yes this is it <laughs>
guys i hope you guys enjoy this video i think i've mentioned everything about my room if you have any questions please do ask um i'll be making videos about the uni um student accommodations etc prices whatever whatever but yeah you get given this id it's free um with your name on it you access you to buildings your room your flat everything um obviously if you do get yourself locked out you just go to the visitor center which where the security is based um they'll give you like a temporary card uh which it lasts 10 minutes to come and open the door and then you get given your id well you come and get your id from your room but yeah so each flat has 10 people i think every flat has 10 people there are some studios in here don't know what buildings in to be honest um but you guys i think that's it so i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you do have any questions please do ask um and yeah guys make sure to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you on my next video